Hey, what's up, everybody? Gabriel Hill with Chrome Unbox. Uh, we just got an update to the Canary channel of Chrome OS, and in it, we found a new flag that is uh, a feature Robbie uncovered a few weeks ago. It is screen capture mode. It's just a new way to take screen grabs and screenshots on your device. Uh, following that, uh, Denson over at Chrome Story discovered that this is actually going to be used for screen recording as well. So you can scroll your web page or record your screen. It's it's going to be a built-in tool that could possibly replace things like Loom and other screencastify and stuff like that. Um, it's going to add a whole new level of productivity to Chrome OS, whether it's for school, work from home, whatever the case may be. Maybe you're a gamer and you want to record some video games you're playing, Stadia, whatever. Uh, this is just going to be baked into the device. It's going to be similar to um, the Windows Snippet tool, except the Windows Snippet tool is a pain to use. Most people don't even know it's there. And when you take a screenshot with it, if you don't use Windows regularly, who knows where that image goes because it doesn't go directly to the downloads file. As far as I know, we spent five minutes the other day trying to find an image on a Windows device that we had used the Snippet tool on. Anyway, that's neither here nor there. With this new flag enabled, you'll see the screen capture button right here in the system tray and you can hit that and you'll get your toolbar but instead i was tinkering around trying to find a shortcut for it and realized that the partial screenshot so control shift screenshot actually brings these tools up uh, they still have some work to do on the little uh, tooltip pop-ups they actually pop up behind the bar right now but the bar itself is styled it looks very googly very chrome os uh, with the camera capture, it does exactly what you think. If you click enter on the full screen here, you're going to get a picture of everything that's in your viewport. Now, the cool feature that we've, we've seen for a few months now is the partial screenshot, but they've updated it to be movable and resizable. So if you go to the resizable screenshot, partial screenshot, you can actually click anywhere on the screen and create your block and then you can resize it and move it around wherever you want. This is perfect for us because we do a lot of 16 by nine images and sometimes you have to crop them on the back end because they're not the right size or whatever. But now you get your image exactly where you want it, hit enter and it's saved in your downloads folder, possibly the camera folder in the future when that becomes a thing. But right now it goes to downloads. Uh, the Windows window capture button does what you would think with the uh, this highlighted, if you do a overview mode and click one of the open windows you have, that's the only thing it takes an image of. Uh, the only thing that's not really working in this right now is the video option. So if you go to video and hit enter, you'll see a recording icon down here in the bottom of the screen by the system tray. It doesn't do anything right now. It says it's recording, but when you click stop, it doesn't do anything. There's no file saved. It's uh, obviously not linked up on the back end yet, but eventually you'll click that stop button. It'll go down to your downloads folder. And now you have a video screen grab of whatever. Uh, this can be a powerful productivity tool and, and it might put some uh, third party extensions out of business, but it's pretty cool and it's going to be forward facing. And I would assume this will be part of the out of the box experience, kind of one of the how to's of how to use your Chromebook. And it's really, really neat and super easy to use. So we'll keep an eye on it and uh, give you any updates on how it's going, coming along and when it makes it up to the dev channel and, and beyond. I would hope we could see it by the end of the year. So till next time, guys, we'll see you.